ever stopped to think about the magic of a matchstick? That tiny, instant flame we carry on our pockets? But it wasn't always so easy to light a fire or a stove. For millennia, making fire required sparks from flint or a lot of wood friction. Imagine the effort. The journey of the match begins with the discovery of the element phosphorus in the 17th century, a material that glowed in the dark, almost magical. The first matches were dangerous and impractical. Some even needed to be dipped in sulfuric acid. Yikes! In 1826, John Walker, an English chemist, invented the first friction matches. They ignited when scraped on any rough surface but they used white phosphorus, which was super toxic. Then, in the mid-19th century, came the big breakthrough. Gustav Erik Pasch and Johann Edvard Lundström in Sweden developed the safety match, the kind that only lights on the striking surface of the box, you know? The trick was to separate the ingredients, part on the match head, part on the box. Genius, and much safer. This revolutionized how the world made fire. From the campsite to the kitchen, the little match became essential. Then came the Strike Anywhere matches, and today we even have waterproof and windproof ones. From flint to the colorful little box, it was a long journey. So, the next time you strike a match, remember all the science and history packed into that tiny flame. A spark of genius, don't you think?